Hey guys, well, we got some snow today. About an inch actually is all we got. Kind of on the back side here, there's the outhouse and the shed. I mean, everything that came down today melted. So I mean, nothing stuck to the roof, nothing, everything, it came down so warm. But, so I figured that was all wet. I didn't want to do anything with it while it's wet. So I'm gonna wait for it to dry. But I thought we had a temporary window that we were gonna put in for here to get some light into the addition since it's starting to, since we're closing off up above, we got no light in there whatsoever. So to get some natural light in, we had this window in the temporary bathroom. I thought, let's just put it in there temporarily until we get our permanent windows. So I cut that in tonight. Um, but there'll be actually three windows on this side and then there'll be a door in that corner. Cause eventually where I'm standing here will be a walk, a four foot raised walkway that'll go to our deck. But that's kind of what I did tonight, and then probably tomorrow if it's still clear, since we don't have to do snow, I might put the other two windows in the in our pantry on the other side, since we have those two windows, and get that done so we can get some light in. Because once I'm done up there, getting that roof all covered and that end wall on that end done, then I'm going to move inside and start working on the bathroom and the pantry and getting that weather, getting that insulated and warmed up more so we can actually start using it so it's kind of where we're at right now and we'll kind of go from there from here and I'll just take videos as we go but yeah beautiful day turned out to be beautiful clear skies and might get a little bit more snow overnight but not a lot probably not even enough that I'll even bother plowing so another update um, had some beautiful weather this afternoon so I got the rest of the ice barrier on that section. So that third is completely done. And I got this whole side done except for the top row. And that I'll wait till the very last because that overlaps on top. Because the wind typically comes from, you know, out of the west. So I wanted to make sure that that overlaps to the other side towards the east kind of like that side did so the overlap is on the downward side of most of our wind so but I still got this like I said I'm using this because this is my access to get up here um, and I ran out of the staples that I need my one staple got to get down in there because I can't my little the cheap hand staple doesn't I can't bend over and reach overreach like that I slide down the roof too far so don't want to do that so I'll be Picking some staples up. They're talking more snow uh, tomorrow into Thursday. And then Friday, Thursday, Friday. Well, basically the next three days, it sounds like. Um, but yeah, so this is done. Sun's pretty much already set. Just see a little pink on the horizon. But the clouds have moved in and got a nice little fire going. The house is nice and warm. So I think I'm going to do a little bit more. Oh, and I'll take you down and show some framing. Bear with me here. Okay, now that uh, I'm down off the ladder, I got this done the other night too. Um, started framing that in. I'll frame this next piece in because this will be a traditional wall segment here. And this will have our, uh, there'll be a window in this part here. And there'll be another one to match mirror that on the other side here. And frame that up so fog I got more material today since I had to make a trip into town anyway so I got more material to do the rest of this so that's kind of what I'm gonna work on tonight but it's gonna get dark here so see how far I get before it gets too dark and my headlamps no longer doing it so but that's kind of where things are at got this side all sheeted ice barrier down on the whole thing Got the full side done, except for this last piece, because I overlap and way I'm overlapping it. I'm gonna got that side all done with ice barrier, and this is sheeted and covered at ice barrier, with the exception of the last row, which I'm gonna work on next. So by the time I'm done today, I'll be able to have this covered up and it's weather tight. So we're gonna get to it, but I'm not gonna film any of it because I need, again, I'm gonna be up on the roof, so I wanna have my phone with me. 
that's kind of where things are at. I got a beautiful sunny day again today. Beautiful day. A little windy, but enough we can get things done. Another update. Got this whole end wall closed in. So we're weather tight for the next snow coming. We've lucked out so far everything else goes has gone through us, but and then I got this last sheet up here done. So our roof is completely covered. And now we're working on this end. So I'm gonna finish framing that lower section is done. I'm gonna do the upper. Then I'll start working on this other side. So hopefully by the time I'm done tonight, I'm gonna have this sheet this side hopefully sheeted up a little bit, at least the first first four feet of it. Get that sheeted up so that uh we're at least a little more weather tight. I'm not going to probably close up all of this just yet because I still have to bring up some more sheets for that end wall. But I think we're getting close, guys. Hey, guys. A little update I'll share with you. Um, I know somebody asked to take more pictures or video of the my uh, snow staircase that I made to get the sheeting up to the second level or in the loft. So we got snow going here. Let me switch my video. But they're starting to come down. They're saying 12 to 18 inches over the next two days. So we'll see, but I'm standing on the very bottom. So here's ground, basically snow level up. So I have some staircase basically built with some leftover scraps. To build myself up and those are probably about 15 to 18 inch steps and then we're down quite a bit here on the ground but yeah that's kind of tip it a little bit so i'm holding this at about eight feet and i still can't see the top of it so it's it's probably from here it's about 10 feet from the other corner it's closer to 15 feet high from down where the entry is the basement crawl spaces so but that's kind of where it is we got some sheeting up like I saw so last night and I'm gonna work on this today and hopefully put in a couple windows here in our what's gonna be our pantry so I'll take more video once I got some free hands
Another quick update. We didn't film it because my phone was dead and I had it on the charger. But we put our two uh, awning windows in our pantry. So that's all. They're all good and going, going tightened up for the weather. So now that we got that all done up there, weather tight, we'll get that wall done. Um, hopefully today or close to the day. Um, but now we can start working on the inside and actually get some stuff inside done. We'll worry about the house wrap later up there and the windows later. But yeah, so we do have some light in our addition finally. Besides that temporary window that I put in earlier. But that's our update. Okay, guys, that's about all I'm going to get done for today. The storm's starting to kick in. But I want to spend some time with the kids as long as they're here. But yeah, so this is all framed up. Leave this, I'm going to leave this open so I can do the sheeting. You know, so I can get up and get the next sheet and that up here. But snow's starting to pick up. But maybe I'll take a video later as it gets more. It's starting to kick in now. Or they're saying 12 to 18 inches. By the time, I think it's by noon on, or one o'clock on Monday, they said we could have up to 18 inches of snow. So anywhere from 12 to 18, so we shall see. But for now, that's what I'm gonna call it a day and spend some time with the family. All right guys, time to dig out. This is what we woke up to this, this morning. We got about 10 inches of snow, probably more. It's hard to tell because it's been blowing around but I'd say we're at the 10 to 12 inch mark, somewhere in that range. But, uh, well, you can see here the grill was cleaned off yesterday. So yeah, it's about a foot of snow. But we're gonna go out and do some plowing, dig ourselves out a little bit, at least temporarily, so the, so the kids are able to get out, because they're getting ready to head home after this wonderful snow. They gotta drive ahead of them. But yeah, it's still coming down, as you can see. But beautiful so next up is some plowing
morning guys we got some more snow still accumulating this had cleaned off this morning so before we did plowing so that's how much we've gotten since we've started plowing but now yeah, we got everything just beautiful so we're gonna and again it here But thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and give us a thumbs up and we'll get started on the next video. Thanks guys, appreciate it.